Welcome back to my channel. I am Georgina. If you've been here before, if you haven't, I am a flight attendant for a mainline carrier in the U.S. of A. Today we are at recurrent training. Every single year as flight attendants, we have to retrain how to like evacuate, how to do medical duties. So here we are in Dallas, Texas. We flew here this morning and we're back where we first met. I know where it all began. It's like one year later, and we're back at the like place we did our training at. So we're so excited to be here. We've already seen some of our friends, and like I'm so excited to see many more. It's kind of like a reunion. Literally. It's not everyone from our class, but it's like most of them. We got this little card. We're checking in at 1:15 to 3 o'clock, and then our class actually starts at 3 o'clock. But I think before then we have to do some drills. So we're just gonna kind of walk around, do some drills. We have to do a drill on every single plane on like evacuating if the plane lands on the land, and then I have to do a ditching if the plane lands on water, and we have to do all that commands for that, wait in line and do all that, and then in class I think we do like medical things. <laughs> Just got back to our room we did drills and then we did a bunch of class stuff it is 7 15 now we are going to get changed and head to the hotel where we did our training at because we are in love with our bartender we love him so much and we are going to go eat at the bar there drink a little bit and then head back here and go to the bar here it does close at 10 so that's kind of boring but i guess it'll get us into bed at a normal time i don't know what we'll do after that maybe just mingle she mingle in the lobby but let's get it room we're gonna go to bed now it is literally like 11 22 we have to wake up in the morning we have to probably be up at like seven because we gotta be down there at like eight we want to do pilates because we noticed they have pilates machines in the gym so like period but we had so much fun tonight we're gonna have so much fun tomorrow this is honestly so much fun like nothing to be scared of a lot of fun <laughs> good morning america 710. <laughs> Gonna get ready. <laughs> running a little hot, but what? <laughs> We're running a little behind this morning. Um, we have to meet everyone in the lobby and look like presentable queens. Check in at 815, but we have to check out of our room and get breakfast right now. <laughs> and We're ready. It is 730. This is what I'm wearing. Black pants, a Ritzia bodysuit, and like Nike Dunks. You know the deal. If there's some time after class, maybe we'll like change and go do Pilates, but I just kind of doubt it at this point because our flight's at five, so we probably do need to leave here around 3.15. We just got done with um, class and now we're gonna eat lunch. Hopefully it's better than yesterday because yesterday was kind of a letdown. The food in the cafeteria was kind of old. I guess we did get there kind of late, maybe like 12. So hopefully since we got there at 10 a.m. it's like really fresh, you know the vibes. But then we're going back to class and then hopefully we have enough time to get a massage like in the gym and the massage chairs. That's the only thing I want in my life. We're gonna head to the airport. We're gonna get home tonight at like 10 p.m. So probably straight to bed. Hey guys, I am filming this a couple weeks later. I am behind on editing right now, but I just wanted to kind of come in and give a recap of CQ, answer some questions that I had that I wanted to be answered for me 
being it's my first CQ. It's basically a reoccurrent training every year that you have to go to. It's like by law. It's kind of to get like a refresher and just like recertify yourself for the next year. It's like a requirement. So I know every airline has to do it, but I don't know if it's going to be dealt with the exact same way as it is at my airline. For my airline, we just went to where we usually go for training and we kind of go over the drills and stuff. It's really important for us as flight attendants to remember the drills and kind of have them as second nature. So if an emergency does happen, we are able to get out like immediately. For me, I was kind of nervous in the beginning, but it's kind of nothing to be scared of. Go through your tablet and read over things like it's nothing to be scared about. They're there to help you, not to like kick you out. I think I was kind of scared it was going to be more like training and less like a refresher or a reminder. You do have to remember your drills, but I noticed they were coming back to me like second nature because obviously I did them during training so much and they kind of just like come to you as you go, which is great because I was kind of nervous about that. It was a great way to kind of get back together with everyone. I don't see a lot of my friends from training all the time since they are based in different places like New York and Philly. And we did have like a little bit of homework to do before we got there. We did like a couple modules like we did in training just to refresh our brain on the different types of aircrafts. And stuff than reviewing the stuff that is in your manual there's really not much to it i think another question i had was going to be like is there second chances i know that there's second and even third chances on drills for us and for group activities you always have somebody that can help you out or the teacher is going to kind of help you out and you can find it and you're not going to be like kicked out if anything it's like a great refresher and so i'm really glad we did it i uh, hope you all enjoyed the vlog i will be having another video out pretty soon i took a month off just because there was a lot going on and i'm doing so much and i just started a line but i'm going to be posting once a week if not twice a week again so thanks for watching